my god. Dude, it's an inferno. Oh my god. Again? Oh my god, it's fucking so bad. how dry these people's yard is oh man oh man oh man all right i'm breathing in smoke and ash like hardcore right now i should probably get a face mask look at that oh my god oh he's dropping he's dropping oh it's right here Oh shit! Let's switch to the other camera. There's literally a house right up there. Look. Hey, are you a YouTuber? Huh? Are you a YouTuber? My what? A YouTuber. What's YouTube? That dude's literally saving that person's house. Hardcore word. Oh no, dude. Oh my god. Oh yeah. That's you? I got you. Yeah. I got you. I'll subscribe. Look, they're fucking coming there to save the day. Sure hope so, man. Oh man, it looks like that house already has a structure caught right there. Yeah. Oh man. This if you look at it zoomed up, it looks like something's burning right there. Like a, like some sort of a structure. Yeah. Like they're shed or something. Bad news for some folks. Uh, Hopefully, I don't know if it would do anything, but oh my god, that fucking house. Is somebody in there?
Oh man, this is this one's more crazy than there it has been. What sucks is the wind's blowing this way, so it's actually, it's like the worst possible outcome. There's a guy up there all in that smoke. Oh my god. Oh no, it's hitting that house. Go, go, go! Fuck out of the way! Damn, we got real so fire even here. trees fucking dropping flames all over that house and I think that's that lady's house
man. They did a great job saving these uh, ridgeline houses here for sure. But uh, I think there's still some houses up there on fire. Alright guys, so uh, it's the next day now and uh, I'm actually really curious to survey the damage here because this this one was a little worse than normal so oh man look at this so here's where all that smoke was oh man look at that house literally literally saved oh man and then that house right there, look, the edge of its roof caught on fire, but they saved it. All the palm trees got fucking shot. And then this house right here, looks like it got burnt a little bit. Wow, there's actually like quite some damage here. Man, these homes. Dude, imagine having one of these homes. And look at that one just hanging over the ridge right there. What I was curious of if, is if it hit up here. It doesn't look like it did. Because this whole side right here is nothing but brush. And this, this would have been a massive gulf of flames. Oh yeah, look. This side thankfully didn't get hit. And they all got their sprinklers on over there. <laughs> See, I was thinking this house right here might have got engulfed. Because this house looks fucking beautiful. Well, so that guy in that house right there is the San Bernardino Councilman. What the hell are the odds of that? And this is the one that got damaged right here. Oh man. Fuck. Wow, it really burned all the way through. Look at that. God, these poor people, man. Oh my god, I'm like on power lines right now. That can't be safe. And then that last fire we had back in the day, it was this house that burned down. Not even back in the day, like a month, a few months ago, this house burned down. Gosh. And it looks like they're already rebuilding it. Oh, did that one burn down too? Look, they're already got like stakes in the ground. Rebuilding the house that burnt down. I don't know how home insurance works, but hopefully that's a process that uh, works well with the homeowner. Cause man, I couldn't fathom that. That's gotta be like at the at the severity level of like losing a family member to losing your your full blown home with just every possession, every life possession you own, and just oh, terrible. I think these guys are doing the the power line stuff. Okay, so the councilman's house had a little bit of roof damage, and then that one house looks like it got the worst. Oh, look at the power company coming in clutch. <laughs> Already coming with the big poles and everything to get a, get their shit fixed. <laughs> 